Hey guys, this is Ardi Techie. Welcome back to Regions of Ruin. I am actually turning this into a Let's Play series that will show up every Thursday. The first episode of the Let's Play is technically the indecent exposure I did. Link to that in the description if you want to check that out. But if you're joining us now, that's fine too. You beat the uh, rogue-ish um platformer game with town building elements so i don't think you'll be lost at all so i'm just gonna click load and it, it's why is it empty apparently it's all empty <laughs> so well, that means i have to go start all over again so i'm gonna just start i'm gonna play in the easiest because i got wrecked when i played in the human difficulty so you can call me it looks like you have a controller plugin would you like to use this controllers yourself let's okay so we are using controllers so you don't have to deal with my clicky clicky keyboard so default I have no idea Darwin kin so this basically so now you don't actually have to watch the indecent exposure episode you feel free to but that's not the first episode this is actually episode one that is so weird I have to say that considering I'm just starting the series but that shows me I mean that shows you how unorganized I am. So this is not gonna end well for anyone watching. So basically, uh, we're dwarves, we lost our lands, we're gonna uh, get it back. That's pretty much it. And now what we're doing is we're actually building our land back little by little. So the thing with these episodes, I, I plan on making them around 15 minutes long. 15 to 20 minutes is my aim which I will probably overshoot, but I actually have my timer going this time. So it should be a little bit better. Um, it's not fully implement fighting using inventory and basic inventory. Uh, maybe we should just uh, unplug the controller. You, I guess you will have to deal with um, clicky clickiness. I apologize. But not so really, be not really because I do love my keyboard. Uh, press E to interact with the scenery and talk to your camera and press return. Okay. Broken on my eye. I'll need some wood to get it fixed. Thank you. Can you think you can help? Rumors. Wood. Occupation. Advice. Okay. So. E to retrieve items from chests. Oh. Hello. Open inventory or click the icon of the toolbar to see what you have. It's the inventory. Alright, so we have... I think that's it, right? I mean, we, we got the stuff. X to attack, B to power hit, left hold... Hold left... Oh, this is still giving me the prompt, but let me... Let me... That's X, B to power hit. Okay, and then hold left trigger to shield. No, is it... No. No. I'm trying to figure out what the shield button is. Ah, uh, this is not gonna be good. Uh, key bindings. What was... This? Remove. None. Okay. Nav movement. General. Um, general. Shield is down arrow. Um, okay, so I'm gonna use shield on my super duper mouse which has like five buttons uh, There you go, okay shield uh Oh, Okay done all right. So, yeah, look at that. I got my super shield now dun 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 When an enemy flashes red before next, it means they are getting tough. Be careful through your shield and do double damage. But you can stop it by hitting before they head out. Oh yes. Oh, I. I like how they changed that. It used to flash. That pop up used to flash every. Every time you um, had that 
enemy raises sword and I actually remarked it was kind of annoying in my video I don't know if that's why the developer changed it or if it was you know just general consensus consensus but either way I am really happy they uh, changed it because smash stuff for supplies that's that's good leather vest how do you there you go okay so now I got do I have the leather vest on excuse my creaky chair I do have it on. Okay, so this I remember a few space move from behind will do double damage. You've just been wounded. Be careful. Wounds will not let you. Recover. There you go. Dead. They. I killed them dead. E to pick up. I don't know what I picked up. Uh, Gauntlet. The next one is facing the other way. You can sneak up to him without being seen. Will do tremendous damage. All right. Left shoulder. Top. Okay. This we got. Oh, that's not it. That's jumping in it. That's obviously not sneak. No. Oh, got it. Should have. <laughs> Choosing anything but the controller. I wish they showed you that it didn't have um, sneak is C. Why did it give me a what? It pressed C and it. Oh what? Oh, that's just the. All oh, right, okay. Boom! There you go. Insta killed. Now you gotta go. I'm sneaky, sneaky. S oh, and if you uh, you have a short window of time before you're revealed. Dun dun dun. Oh yes, insta killed. Damn, I'm so good. <laughs> Fighting in the tutorial level. Uh, I just gotta jump up. Got the helmet. He's got a split scalp. I'm just gonna. E to talk, rumors, save, occupation, heal, advice. Not really listening to people. Wood stockpile. Oh, right. Okay. So I have to jump and dash, I think. It's funny because this is the time that Cuphead came out. <laughs> and it was uh, so controversial how long uh, a video game journalist took to <laughs> get that first level and it included a jump dash and I remember uh, remarking about that dash to skip the tutorial I did dash why am I skipping the tutorial I'll finish the tutorial oh I think I had to go back oh what I lost my helmet damn that was stupid oh well I'll get my helmet rumors Workers, occupation, travel, advice. Okay, I, yeah, I'm, I'm in perfect health. So, okay, so the idea is you use, you spend food, right? Press return to continue. Yeah. Okay, and you get areas that you can explore. So you spend food, you get an area, you explore that, and then you gotta go to that area. Why? Uh, uh, you got, you can travel to that area, and get some stuff done so we finished the tutorial I don't think I'll be doing much this episode because I was banking on my save game being present when I came back obviously uh, the game didn't share my enthusiasm for the game and probably thought I was gonna come back at all but I'm just gonna wreck this dude's things so perhaps you could be of some uh, we could be yep sure Farmer who's taken up residence, some new ruins, who's, who's gone stark mad. Help. Dining in goblins, town border, they're being led by some monstrous orc. Well, this is gonna end well. Don't like give me simple stuff, just, just push a freaking. Apparently, orcs have learned how to train. Wargs? That's a scary thought. What are wargs? Uh, particularly nasty guy when he's clad on iron if you get rid of him 
Might make the other thing twice about coming back. Occupation. Cotton plants, which we told we basically stole their entire stockpile. So we're we're oh food. Forgot about that. Yeah. It's so funny, I spent uh first time I played this, I spent a lot of time just oh, uh just trying to figure out what the hell? You just been okay. Why is it taking so long? Oh crap, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I hate the stamina system. Oh crap. Run. R run, you dump. Oh, I'm dead. I was very quick. All hope is lost. I don't have a load game. Auto save. Load. Fine. I hate these levels. I had trouble with this in the tutorial and the. See, this is the easiest thing, so this should be technically super easy to do, but I'm not. This is the first level. This game's quite challenging. This is why I got destroyed when I played in a harder difficulty. And, um... Yeah, 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 fine, whatever. I, I don't, I'm not gonna help you, really, but, um, uh, whatever. I'm just gonna... What? Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. I actually didn't know you could go into these houses. That, that's good. I'm gonna see if I can steal stuff. Can't. That's a cool way to transition into a house. Oh yes, cotton. Oh, I am stealing all their stuff. Yeah, that's a good, good dwarf. Um, the thing uh, I forgot about is that stamina, and once you lose it, it's really hard to get it back. Okay, bring it, bring it, bring it. So I gotta go, ooh. Gotta go here. This been wounded. I get it, okay. Shoot. The trick, off. Oh. It's Is that, am I dead already? No. Oh god damn it. Buckling under a great pain. This is not can I go in? I can't go in. This is not an easy Oh, I'm just gonna leg it. Screw you all. Get up, get up, get up. Gotta, gotta live, gotta get out from this place, got... Whew, yeah, there's no way I'm gonna... I have to go back, I cannot help those people yet. I need some weapons or something. Admit defeat and run. I gotta heal myself. It's so sh uh, annoying because I had a pretty good setup going storage. Yeah, you'll need to gather some wood and leather to build one. Because I had all the, you know, the stuff from the tutorial, but I lost it because I went to the right, not, not the left. So what is this? I don't have any of that. I don't. I need wood for tavern. They, I think I have a feeling they added more stuff. I don't know. P to level. Yes, I will level. Right. Um, different abilities, and you can toggle between them to change the behavior of your appropriate move. Small icons like these are passive bonuses. All right. Strength, I guess. I'm thinking strength works for me. So I'm gonna enable this ability. And then. This is what? This is the ability to make standard quick slashes with left. Let's increase the force of your attacks. Push enemies back. What am I doing? Am I clicking something? And am I not. 
I don't know what's going on. Okay, so obviously I did something there. I'm in perfect health, so that's good. Uh, let's go to travel. We're gonna go to this bit right here. Alright. Karen, okay, I'm gonna explore that bit. Alright, you go. Travel. Let's see what that is. It's a challenging game. It looks very simple, but it they the enemies kind of rush you and you're so screwed if you're not careful. I think this is the one with the wolves. I remember one with the wolves. And that is freaking nuts that one. The one with the wolves. I like the environment setup and all that. You just break things and you just steal. You're basically the worst person in the world. You walk into towns and you just steal. Oh wow, that didn't have any um, bad people. I'm just gonna go there, explore there. Let's go to travel there. So basically, it's kind of like a random throw of the dice. I don't remember if it's actually procedurally generated or anything, but um, it's going to be interesting. Okay. I'm going to make sure I save this time, though. Oh, yeah. This is the one with the wolf. No, kobolds. Never mind. Uh, this is another one. This, this was the one I had trouble with in the tutorial. <coughs> Sorry, uh, in the tutorial. Uh, advice. If you're gonna help, feel free to whatever supplies. Sure, damn right. I, it's not like I needed your permission because I'm gonna do it anyways, right? Yeah, the monies apparently don't want apples anymore. Maybe there's a limit. Um, let me just check this one. And then, obviously, gotta save before I go attack any of the horrible people. See, I knew I had no use for most of those apples because I'm not picking it, but it's just so much more satisfying to destroy them. I am gonna save my game. Hopefully, let's play. I'm gonna save my game. I'm gonna give this a a, a try right now, but I don't expect it to be any good. See, no point in doing it, but I'm just doing it. Oh, there it is. Okay, these are the kobolds. Nope. Recharge. Boom. Yeah, this is the skill that helps you out a lot. The knockback. So as they don't have any like long range, you're pretty much sorted. See, it's much easier this way. I'm apparently still in perfect health. That is really impressive considering I died a lot. So cool. So cool. Super cool. Alright. So now I'm gonna save again because that's a pretty good uh, area. Confirm. I'm gonna go rush into here. See, this actually feels more familiar. I gotta get sustained heavy wounds. That's not cool. Why am I not a eating any apples? Area cleared. Woo! That was that was close. For more than five seconds, you can open your map to travel either in the toolbar or pressing M. I'm gonna just loot the entire garrison. Yep. Oh, I did not see. I did not think you could destroy those. Okay, that's. See, I th I'm not someone who pays attention to stuff. <laughs> Ah, uh, leather vest. All right, let's go. Let's go to the end of the map. All right, and then I'm gonna go back to the caravan because I'm feeling a bit. I need to get healed, things like that. And I think I'm gonna call that the end of the episode of the first episode of the Let's Play series featuring Regions of Ruin. If you wanna join, 
for uh, join me for the next episode. It's gonna be next Thursday. Every Thursday, an episode of Regents of Ruin is gonna go up. The plan is to do at least one month, one game, and then I change over to another game. So if you have a game in mind, let me know. And if it's something I have to buy, I'll look into it. I can contact the developer, whatever it can do. Uh, that's it for this episode. Thank you for watching. Hit like and subscribe if you like the content. If you didn't, let me know why and I can hopefully improve it. This is RD Techie. Hope you have an awesome day ahead. See ya.